21 percent 71 input from solar and we're 30 I said the reserve power uh, basically minimal power at 20 percent so anytime this two should switch so just got this I'm not sure how this thing discharge sounds like they should discharge in the same rate but apparently after you just hook up this has a lower power percentage than that so I'm curious one charging six amp hour four six amp hour battery XR battery what would it look like let's wait for it when it drop to 20 percent the AC should switch off but that's only if there's no extra extra battery now we have an extra battery what would happen we'll still switch off and not and ignore this or still charging from the extra battery to here into that thing oh let's wait for oh, just the time timer for the lcd screen lcd or led i think it should be lcd all right Wait for it. Twenty one percent. I'm going to switch to twenty percent. This could be a very long video. I'm just sitting here waiting. Any moment, uncut, raw footage, real time, and we'll see what happened when Delta Two Max. And this is also a Dell 22 Max extra battery, but it's a Delta 2 1024 watt battery, not the 2000. So this is 2000, 1000, make this 3072 watts total. Okay. What would happen when it hits? It didn't charge. It turned those guys off. It didn't take from the extra battery. It just stopped. And what the f what the hell I'm doing with the extra battery? What the hell? It is at port two. Is that the reason? Because at the port two. I don't know. Let me switch to port one and see what happened. But uh, yeah, it didn't use any juice from the extra battery. So I switched to port one from port two. And we're back to 21% and 30. Are we going to get any help from the extra battery? Again, nothing. We get nothing from the extra battery. I just plug it into the wall. A quick test. We're not charging the battery on top. We're running. I restricted to 800 watts. So we're running about 800 watts down there. And to see if I charge this up to 30%, we'll both then charge up. And then down in the same time okay we just charged from 28 percent to 31 percent and this thing is not moving the the extra battery so we switch back and uh it's not charging up nor discharging down what is going on they are connected they're not really connected. So it's 32% here now. And it's 30% on top. What's happening? So if you won't discharge to it, nor you will give it. What is happening? 
talk to the customer service. The Delta II battery, the 1000, only work with the 1000. So this two, as soon as I plug in the 30%, this 85%, this battery is dumping power into that. Okay, so it looks like they try to equal equal out the battery as we speak as we speak. That means this is a 2000 watt, 2 kilowatt system. But this battery, the Delta 2 battery does not work with Delta 2 Max. So you couldn't make a 3000 kilowatt system, which nowhere stated on the website or anywhere. Uh, they apologize. So in order for me to upgrade my my main charge system by the solar panel from 2000 up, it's there's the only choice is the according to NEN is the Delta 2 Max extra battery that's obvious or the Delta Max battery which is 2016 watt battery. They say it will work. So it looks like the way they do it is either this guy gets 2000 or get 1000. But the Delta Max or Delta 2 Max can only go up or even. It cannot go down. Well, I guess it couldn't go up because the maximum battery they have is 2000 kilowatt. Uh, 2000 watt, which is 2 kilowatt. And uh, it doesn't take 1 kilowatt batteries. That's a disappointment, obviously. It's a really big disappointment. But I guess uh, my 3000 kilowatt system doesn't work. Now we are, it's okay. This is the main TV set setup. So this will operate everything. It just sucks now I have to carry this to the solar system charging part. Uh, okay. Instead have just one piece, like this guy gets charged all the time. Now I gotta carry this too, because now this battery has to go stay with this. The only way to charge this brand new, they're all brand new, this is the first time using it, in order to charge this brand new Delta 2 battery is with Delta 2. You cannot charge Delta 2 battery with Delta 2 Max upstairs earlier you see okay that's good to know it sucks but that's the way it is so i guess it's slowly trickling charge it's outputting and inputting i think that what's happening after 20 hours this will even out So I guess in order to save one discharge cycle, have them break even, uh, is for me to just charge charge it up and have them discharge in the same time. Otherwise, I just waste a charge cycle for this guy. Okay. Okay, both is at 100%. 100%, 100%, I just powered it with the cord. Here's the thing. This piece and this piece, they like to sync even on the percentage. So in order to let it sync, I need to charge them at the same rate. Like right now it's 100%, 100%, so this will drop altogether. Okay, so I did waste about 1.5 kilowatt to charge this up, but I have a way to run the solar cable, the panel all the way, the wire temporarily, from where the upstairs is and run to the back of this machine. And this is the way I have it set up. Okay, and there is a energy man not energy, energy management system setting in the app. 
you can set as a backup power. So I set the backup power to the lowest 25%. When I need to charge it from the wall, I push up to 100. So the backup power is different than the energy reserve. I guess that is the energy reserve. So anything below 25%, it will charge from the wall. Anything above it, if my solar bring the 75% to this, it will use 75% of the first 75% from the solar, which in the battery. And then when it hits 25%, it will charge, maintain at 25%, won't go any lower. Once you turn the option off, the AC in the back, you have this uh, power limitation bar thing. Um, you can set whatever, I have 120%. So at 20%, Anything below 20%, the AC outlet in the back will turn off. Okay, that's different than the power reserve, energy reserve. The energy reserve is for the AC of, from the wall to charge to the unit. Am I making any sense? Okay, so when the power below 25 or hit 25%, it will take from the wall. Anything above it, 75%, it will, t it will take from the battery. And I just need to charge keep this above 25% to use 100% solar the whole time. Okay, if we wanna use the entire set, I can turn that option off and we'll go use the entire 100% of this system. Okay, that is, I guess, uh, the conclusion, the experiment, what we found out today is this machine likes to sync exactly same percentage and only work for Delta two only work for Delta two Delta two extra power extra battery only work for Delta two power station does not work on Delta two max you have to get a Delta max battery or Delta two battery the Delta max battery is a lithium ion battery it's not the light bulb like four battery that can run 3000 cycle, but it has the higher densities. Basically the, uh, the electric car, electric vehicle, the cell phone battery at a 1000 or 2000 Watts. And that particular battery, the old battery has a higher density compared to this has a lower density and it's heavier. The other, the older battery is lighter, but doesn't have as much life cycle. So a thousand to two thousand cycle, but has a higher density. I think maybe good if you don't move it, because for one thousand to two thousand, we're talking about three years to six year cycle. Because with the higher density as a backup power, it will pump out more power to the machine. But I think it makes no almost no difference. It is slightly cheaper, and almost thinking with the price difference and the weight differences with the lighter weight for the older battery, but with a higher energy density, it might be good to get a battery with a higher density, but it, it is easier to catch on fire. The Life 4 battery doesn't catch on fire or almost to minimum. So it is a choice. Um, Think about it. I will give you more update to what kind of battery I need to get for my Delta 2 Max. Apparently this one doesn't, the Delta 2 extra battery doesn't work for Delta 2 Max battery uh, setup. So I need to get two kilowatt battery. It's either the old battery set up from the Delta Max or the higher density energy battery or the Life 4 battery, which is a longer life cycle, heavier and it's more stable. They both are really stable battery. I'm almost inclined to do the solid old battery. We'll see. Thanks for watching and leave your feedback in the comments. Almost nobody watched my video, but if you got any question, ask me, okay? Thank you.